Steve, hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Too. Sorry for making you talk into a tribble. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember the other? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. The trouble with tribbles. You, the trouble with tribbles. Exactly. Are you responsible for this? Yeah, for my sins. This yes. is absolutely magnificent. Is it entirely Meccano? It is entirely genuine Meccano, apart from the gun barrels, which I had turned myself. Right. And the little electric motors from China, which are great little things, because yeah, the Meccano yeah. ones were too underpowered. And I really didn't. Apart from that, it yeah. was all, all genuine Meccano. Fantastic. What, what people can't see on the other side of here, maybe we'll get the camera around here in a moment, is you've got a control panel with uh, uh, what well, looks like a SCART connector on it and lots of plugs yeah. and switches, giving you the ability to be able yeah. to uh, activate some of these motors and, and that kind yeah, of just stuff. Just ordinary so. motors, batteries, hardwired, just mm -hmm. ordinary switches. No, no computing or the SCART yeah. cable isn't sending signals, it's just yeah, using yeah. that. It's just, it's, it's just, just, a, electrical, just yeah, electrical connections. Yeah. yeah, 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 fantastic. So, um, a question for you. How long, a pro I mean, if, how long approximately did it take you to put this together? So far, it's about six years. Six years, uh, yeah. I reckon about another six months to finish it. Right. Because I'm now doing the cladding, the whole cladding around the outside. So the, okay. all the hard part's done, which you'll oh, see right. here. Oh, so, right, so, so there's more to do then. You're yeah, actually yeah, yeah. going to put together uh, the whole of this ship, are the you? The entire hull, yeah. Are you? That's fantastic. Brilliant, brilliant. What was, what was particularly difficult about this build? What was the challenging... I mean, surely there must have been loads of challenging bits, but what was the, the most challenging bit of this of this build? Um, the most challenging, probably the logistics of making sure I could put it together and take it apart in modules. Yes, because yeah. you can't transport something like this in one piece. Right, right. right. So it's actually in four discrete sections. The okay. structure lifts off. Right. Okay. Okay. And yeah. So, so, so there's, so there's a base, there's a base then, and and, and the grey bit on the top here, is, it, does that you say it, that lifts yeah, off? It's just held there by okay. gravity. If I just, right. Yeah. Just lifts off. Yeah. And all the mechanical connections disconnect as I lift off. Okay. Because all Fantastic. the motors are actually in the centre section. Yeah. There's no motors up here. Right. Oh, really? So yeah. you've got drive bars running yeah. up through there, have you? you right. Has, okay. Has, yeah. Well, I'm not, yeah. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. 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 No, I can see now. We'll get but the camera down there in there in a little while. Yeah. 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 There are things which engage when this yeah. drops into position, and that that makes it all turn. Wow. Similarly for wow. the aft section. You've got prop shafts running yeah. all the down the length of this. Loads of them. Yeah. That's when unbelievable. It, yeah. When yeah. it gets taken apart, all yeah. the, the mechanics disengage automatically. There's no electrical connections across the joints. Right. 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 So just so hmm. so you, you'll have a, a, a cog. And, yeah. a, and, and another cog and they'll slide Thanks. apart and then um, that's it. Oh, I wouldn't pull it apart now, no, don't worry. No, no. I'll show you something. Yeah. I'm going to show you how easy it is to take this apart. Okay, okay, so just quickly then, what Steve's done is he's turned off all of the motors and all the drive systems, so nothing's moving. And then what are you going to do, Steve? Show you how it comes apart very quickly. Okay. For transport. It's pin jointed. If I pull out a top pin here. Oh, wow, okay, yeah. He says trying to pull it out. Yeah, I see it's moving. It's it's, it's nearly there. It's nearly there. <laughs> and, that comes. and there it goes. And yeah. It, oh, and then it. Oh, look at that. Pull out two bottom Oh pins. wow! And all of these gears and right. cogs in here. Now, now those cogs are wearing down be, in and here. And that would be turning yeah. propeller shafts. Okay. So and if I turn that off. off yeah, and, and then it back, goes, back up a little bit, back up a little bit, there we go, and then close that up. up. All engages yeah, All engages again. That's absolutely magnificent. That's, that really is amazing. really, really, really innovative design Job work. Done. Yeah, good stuff. Good. Boom. Off they go. That's fantastic. As a kid, I got, um, you know, uh, uh, a Meccano set from my grandfather, and I must admit, I... I played around with it, you know, I made stuff out of it, maybe some small cranes and that kind of stuff. I never actually dreamed that you could put something together as complex as this yeah. with it. It shows the versatility on it. Steve, thank you so much. That's absolutely fantastic. What a great piece of artwork and what a wonderful piece of engineering as well. Thank you very much. Awesome. Cheers.